Here's a fun Beatles song, uh, Help. We're going to have a look at this. It um, It's not too difficult, a lot of fun to do. So, um, when I was younger, so much younger than today, I never needed anybody helping anyway. But now those days are gone, I'm not so self assured. And now I find I've changed my mind, I've opened up the door. Help me if you can, I'm feeling. Appreciate you being around. Help me get my feet back on the ground. Won't you please, please help me? So, where to start? All right, first, uh, first the chords, pretty straightforward. We need a B, mi uh, B, B minor. I'm gonna change my camera here so you can see what I'm talking about. There you go. Uh, B minor is gonna be first finger on the. B, that is on the uh, A string. Uh, third finger is on the fourth fret of the D string. Pinky finger is on the fourth fret of G string. And second finger is on the third fret of the B string. And that gives you a B minor. Now we're going to play that A just to open all by itself. That's the open A string. And now G. That is a regular old G. So you can play that uh, third finger on the third fret, second finger on the second fret of the A, and pinky finger on the uh, third fret of the G. And now, boom. So G, F sharp, down to the E, regular old E, so that's open E, second fret of the A string, second fret of the D string, first fret of the G string, and an A. You're going to play the A a couple of different ways. Here's one way to play it, right? And here's another way to play it up here on the fifth fret. That's first finger on the uh, fifth fret of the one string and the two string. Uh, second finger on the sixth fret of the three string and third finger on the seventh fret of the fourth string. That gives us a chance to go eventually when we get to that, that part. So, um, go back to the B minor. I need somebody to the A, right? To the G. Help, not just anybody. You know, I need someone. doing is I'm playing uh, my first and second first and second fingers on the uh, ninth fret of the E string and the G string and then the seventh fret of both of those strings and then I'm making a regular A as I described before first finger on the fifth fret of the one and two strings second finger on the sixth fret of the three string and third finger on the seventh fret of the fourth string so it sounds like this now to the uh, to the verse. A. When I was younger, so much now to a C sharp minor. Younger than today. F sharp minor. I never needed anybody. So now we're going to switch from a D to a G to a A. Help in a way. So I'll try that again. When I was younger, so much younger than today. I never needed. Bodies helping anyway. Next line is an A, but now those days are gone. I'm back to a C sharp minor, not so self assured. Now to the F sharp minor again, and now I find I've changed my mind. And D, G, and A again. I've opened up the door, so the whole uh, verse goes When I was younger, so much younger than today, I never needed anybody. In any way, but now those days are gone. I'm not so self assured, and now I find I changed my mind. I've opened up the door. Now, the chorus as a B minor, help me if you can. I'm feeling down, and now we're going to go from that B to the A. Just uh, hit uh, individual notes B, second fret of the A string, A, open A string, and now we're going to go play a G. Do appreciate you being round G, and then a half a step down to F sharp, and then G. So that's enough for us to get started with. This is a great tune, and it's not hard to play. Just take your time, and uh, as always, play it way slower than you want to. Just as slow as you can. Just get the changes down, uh, and sing very slowly to yourself. Like I would start this if I was learning out, I would go. When I was younger, so much younger than today, I never needed anybody's help 
in any way. And that's where I start something, just because, you know, it's easier to do slow uh, correctly, and then this speed will come the way you want it to.